title of this email, what's the easiest way to intermittent fast? That's a good email. It's a damn good email. Yeah. I ain't reading the fucking email. Yeah. I already know what he's asked. But anyway, there's so many different ways to intermittent fast, right? Mm -hmm. You got the um, the one we like, the 16-hour fast, right. eight-hour eating window. Right. You got some other ones where you just, just eat one meal, eat one meal fast for 20 hours, and eat one damn meal, and that's it. Some people eat one day, next day don't eat shit. Yeah, yeah. But in our humble opinion, yeah, not talking shit on anybody else's philosophy. I'm not throwing any shade over this bitch. Yeah. Like we that. got none but love for intermittent fast. Right. None but love. I would say the easiest way to do intermittent fasting is the way we do it. We do a 16-hour uh, fasting window, mm -hmm. eight-hour eating window. Now, that 16-hour fast, majority of that shit yeah. is at night when we're asleep. Yeah. It's easy not to eat. Yeah. Right? We stop, eating around, we stop eating around 7, 8 o'clock. If I'm feeling real good, I stop at 6 if I'm really... Motivated to cutting some fat. Yeah. Shit. By the time I wake up, which is around between 8 and 10, mm -hmm. more often than not, I'm waking up at 10 because I ain't got nowhere to be. And you've been up all night watching forensic files on <laughs> headline, <laughs> headline news watching TV. That's a damn good show, man. Yeah. But anyway, majority of our time has been fasting while we're asleep, right? So mm -hmm. when we wake up, we've been fasting anywhere from 12 to 14 hours already. Yeah. Then from there, I skip breakfast. I go right to the gym. Only thing I consume is my pre-workout, which is pre-gains. Well, you don't skip breakfast. It's impossible to skip I just, breakfast. I, I, I push it up. Yeah. Don't I don't say, skip breakfast. I just push it up a couple hours. Yeah. That's all I do. I don't skip it. Don't be saying that bullshit you skipping breakfast. I, I, I'm not saying that. I, I'm just saying I push it up. Yeah. The only thing I consume when I wake up before I go to the gym is my pre-workout. Which is pre-games. <laughs> you can only buy that shit at officialharshtwins.com. And when you're fasting, you can, you can uh, of course, drink water. Anything that has no calories in yeah, it. Black Each, coffee. Um, I mean, you could take a pre-workout. Black can take, coffee. Yeah, black coffee. Um, With some stevia in it. Like BCAs. You Don't put no sugar in it. Put some stevia in it. Yeah, like BCAs. You can take stuff like that. Yeah. Anything that doesn't have any calories in it. Yeah, right? vitamins, beta-alanine, if you're mixing that in with your pre-workout. Yeah, yeah. 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 Um, whey protein. That's got calories. Can't take that shit. That's actually food. But you can take, like my brother said, you can take the branch chain yeah. amino acids. We also sell that too on officialharshtwins.com. <laughs> it's called BCAA Gains. And it's very useful drink when you fast. Yeah, when you're cutting actually. Yeah, yeah. But anyway, that's the easiest way. To intermittent fast. And if you do that, man, you'll cut in all kinds of fat. Yeah, now intermittent fasting is a weight loss tool. Yeah. It's not gonna put all these slabs and pounds of muscle in your body. Yeah. Or anything will, like that. It will help you shed the fat so you can see your muscle that you've yeah. gained. Especially yeah. around your abs. Right. That's what it will do. Yeah. It's not gonna turn you into some big muscle bound growth. Yeah. Yeah. You gotta put time in the gym for that shit. Yeah. But it's just advice. Do whatever the fuck you want to do. Splits versus full body routine. <clears throat> fuck off me. Hey, Keith and Kevin. I've been working out for the last two years doing splits. Um, but there are some guys and trainers in my gym saying and insisting that full body routine is so much better. 